Hi, and welcome to Kazumi's presentation here on the newest App Exchange product by Kazumi. You can see a lot of different products on uh, the App Exchange, like Git Satisfaction, Ripple, and DocuSign. But you know, if you're looking to put documents into Salesforce, how do you do it? A lot of people come to App Exchange. You type in the word document, and let's see what you find. So a couple different things come up. You'll see the one that we have is called drag and drop and upload multiple documents. It's one of the easiest apps out there. We have tons of customers using it um, from banks to small you know, dry cleaners that use Salesforce. So if you click more, this will bring you to the page where you're going to want to you know, take a look at what you're you know, wanting to do with this app. And also, you know, look at some of the details around it. We've got tons of reviews, you know, rave reviews. We're one of, you know, one of 15 that are competing for the Dreamforce uh, 12 uh, app um, here. And of course, you'll see the provider is Kazumi. So if you go over and click get it now, this is where we start, you know, log into the app exchange with your Salesforce credentials and then download and install this in your Salesforce. So you've got a couple different choices. You've got, you know, you, you can, you can put it into your Salesforce sandbox, or you can put it into your Salesforce live account. It's really up to you. Um, we uh, provide you with a couple different choices here. So if you want to, I'll just go ahead on this uh, demo and install it in my production, which is our dev account for Kazumi. And uh, a couple check boxes later, uh, confirm and install this. And let me get my password real quick to log into Salesforce. You got to do a double login. Uh, when you're at, uh, installing App Exchange products. And then you'll see some of the uh, package. Now, I already had a package in my Salesforce, so I'm actually upgrading from the drag and drop to the drag, drop, and upload. Um, so if I click Next, and then I'm going to give this to all the users in my Salesforce account, so I'm going to grant access to all users, and then I'll just click Next. Once I install this, you know, it's really going to make my life easier, especially my boss, uh, to be able to drag and drop different documents into an account record, a lead record, uh, contact record, anywhere I like to put those documents that are relevant to the customer or prospect that I'm uh, dealing with. So what I'm going to do now is I need to add a button that will allow me on the account record or lead record, you can put it in both places, to put documents on there. So it's pretty simple. I can name it what I want, put in a simple description. And in the uh, documentation that we provide uh, out of the box on the uh, App Exchange product, you can get a single line of code, and you'll want to put that right where you see the cursor there. So I've put that in. I'll show you what the document looks like uh, that you get with the app. So you just need to go down, cut and paste that. Um, it's the drag and drop and upload app and then put that back into Salesforce. So that's really it. Once I click uh, Save here, it'll take me back to a, uh, well, I'll check the syntax first. It'll take me back to the screen where I want to be. Now, next what I have to do is I have to put that button on a layout. So if you put it on the account record, it needs to be on the account layout for all your users or the users that you want to be able to drag and drop and upload documents and contents on. So I'll go ahead and do that. So I've created a customer here. I'll go ahead and edit the layout. And then I've had the old button, so I'll just replace that button. If you look at this one, it's uh, attached documents. So I'll just exchange that and take out that one and put in a new button for that. Now what this will allow me to do is when I click that button, I can easily drag and drop and upload those documents or contents that I want. And it's really that simple. So I'll click that button, attach documents, and you'll see that I can now go to my desktop, anywhere I like where I have documents, and drag and drop those in there. Now, I've, I've kind of got a bunch of different documents here for this account. What I'll do is I'll just select them all and drag and drop those into Salesforce. Now, instead of wait, I mean, it may take a few seconds. We'll just let these go through and then see how they look in Salesforce on that account.
So if I scroll down to the bottom here, you can see that all the documents I got from my desktop, you know, magically appear in Salesforce. I've got those for a record. Um, now, any Salesforce uh, user uh, that's on that account can see in real time, you know, the documents applicable. So go ahead and try drag and drop. Let us know what you think and vote for us for number one on the App Exchange going up to Dreamforce 12. Thank you very much.